Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. This is Regan Elite here with another episode of Speaking My Mind. How are you guys doing? I hope you're all doing well. <clears throat> you can tell I'm still trying to get my voice back from, uh, uh, from my front faction. By the time you guys see this, it would have been cleared up just for the ref just for reference, guys. It will be cleared up by then, I can assure you. But, um, um, but uh, yeah, it's a Monday morning here, very cloudy, so it could rain at any time. Never bother checking the weather report because I just don't bother. Sometimes I just go and just see how things go. But this is literally the day after the half term has officially ended, so pretty much everyone has gone back back to work, shall we say? Uh, and I've come back to doing my content as well as well today as well so um but what did i want to talk about today guys i've, I've talked about it before but i want to talk about it a bit more here and it's about healthcare um, or looking after your health in particular because while i am not a hundred percent i also understand how important it is to get myself off uh, not rely on uh, the lens slip and the cough syrup and and that uh, and the, the everything that helps helps me with recover from my throat infection that I had. Yes, of course, when it's really bad, you need it, um, but you don't want to rely on it. You don't want to keep taking it, if you know what I mean. Um, to, I know it's different for everybody else, but this is just my perspective, obviously. So you can take it with a pinch of salt, obviously, when it comes to your healthcare. You always want to, tr for me, my, my position has always been the case of, you always want to try and let your body try and deal with issues, deal with diseases and whatnot itself. Um, you want your white blood cells to the white blood cells it's very important white blood cells to be able to tackle whatever comes at your body and be able to tackle it rather than you relying on medication or medicine to do so obviously as you get older in life your body is not as strong your white blood cells are a lot weaker so they cannot protect you as well as they used to do so you're having to rely on medicine and that to prolong your life and prolong and protect yourself from diseases and whatever things become your way because it's just perfectly natural uh, for anybody to have such things but when you are a certain age when you're a young i don't consider myself young 36 is not young some people would disagree with me but um i think it's really important to uh when you are really really bad then obviously you obviously you take medic medicine and whatnot but i i try not to rely so much on on medicine i don't like relying on medicine i like to try and let my body deal with it itself uh to try and build up a sort of immune system from things and that's kind of and that's not to say that you shouldn't take medicines that you shouldn't take things uh, but that's just kind of the premise of that uh, premise of that so because you want to be able to to deal with whatever comes at you in life um, and not having to rely on taking things now I'd be a bit of a hypocrite if I didn't say that I didn't take paracetamol whenever I get headaches or migraines um, I do suffer from them from time to time every now and then as well but that's that's kind of when the when you're staring at a screen or a phone like i am right now uh a computer screen for a quite a long period and if you're not taking regular breaks obviously that could lead to migraines as well uh a little tenure that i get from migraines is something that i call information overload when you're thinking about too many things and too many stuff's coming in your mind like i am right now it can lead to migraines and that i always try to Sometimes it can, I can't help myself sometimes when I'm trying to think of so many things that's going on in my head um, it can lead to me getting migraines as well um, but as a backup while I'm uh, out I still have some some uh, uh, what they call holes some throat sweeteners that just help with the throat in case it gets really really bad um, they, they're not really they're not too bad to be fair um, but I've got them in case I absolutely need them my throat is a little bit it was okay when I was doing recording this morning. It wasn't that too bad, um, but obviously, uh, it, hopefully it will clear up as well. Um, part of me felt like when I recorded again, after the week off that I had, that I felt like my voice was not, no longer gonna be the same again. I think, I think it definitely sounds a little bit different to what it did before I had the week off. And it was obviously, it just wasn't how I wanted it to be either, because my partner had the week off, and the only thing we did during the week um, was go and see Wolverine versus Deadpool. 
the poor Wolverine. That was it. So, <laughs> um, and that was in later of the week because earlier in the week I was just buggered. I just could not, I couldn't do much. Uh, my throat, I couldn't talk. And, uh, and uh, I, I remember one time we walked to the shops and I was struggling just to walk to the shops. And that's like, like less than five minutes away, less than five minutes. And I walked quite a pretty, pretty fast pace. I couldn't walk. I was, I was struggling. I was struggling. We did do one day where we walked uh, to the park here. I think it was like a Thursday or a Friday. One day before we went to the cinema. And even I struggled to walk uh, here. Um, but I wanted to walk here even though I wasn't feeling 100% still. I'm uh, not feeling 100%, but I was a bit worse then. But I wanted to get out of the house and I wanted to kind of just get away from the home for a the house for a little bit, which I felt was really, really important. Um, but uh, yeah, it was not the week, a week that I want to remember, guys. It really is. But me and my missus, hopefully, uh, we've got a holiday in October. Cross fingers. I'm not sick. She's not sick, and it all goes uh, that we're both okay for it. And um, and uh, we have a great time in October when that comes round. Obviously, closer to the time you guys are not about that. Um, it's not very often that we take big holidays abroad. Um, but kind of going off topic, obviously. Like I said, this is speaking of mine. I just randomly talk off my thoughts. Obviously, <clears throat> even though, like, I didn't feel like wanting to do this big walk today on Monday morning. I was like, I need to get back into a routine. I need to get back into a routine. I need to for my health and whatnot. And if I, if I feel I'm able to, I'll do, I'll do my workout as well today if I'm able to. If I feel I'm able to as well because the body needs it, you know. Body needs to be kept moving, and kept energized and all that kind of stuff. So, um, but like I say, everyone, it's different to everybody, uh, how, they, how they respond to certain things that come at you. Um, it certainly uh, really did uh, annoy me because it really hurt the channel. Um, um, believe it or not, I'm actually quite surprised that the subscriber count did not drop off a cliff. I was expecting the subscribers to drop and it didn't. Um, so obviously people were very understanding. But I guess a community post when you tell people what's going on, keep people informed and whatnot, it does help. Um, so I think it's really important to try, especially when you have a ch channel like mine, to try and keep people informative of what's going on as much as you possibly can. But hey-ho, what can you do? So, but... Um, yeah, so I should be over it now, but uh, let me know what you guys think about healthcare, how it affects you, how you respond to it and whatnot. Uh, have you guys suffered from throat infections and whatnot? And uh, what you guys normally do to recover yourself from it? Let me know your thoughts and more about any kind of healthcare or whatever in the comment section down below. Like, share and subscribe as always. Thanks guys for watching and I hope to catch you all very, very soon.